Sheriff says the county jail is quickly approaching capacity. The county's capacity is 1,574 inmates. Right now, Wake County has 1,499 inmates booked. And that number changes daily. You do the math, that only really leaves 75 beds open. WRL's Julian Grace spoke with the sheriff today. Julian, joining us live now from outside of the Wake County Detention Center. Julian, how do county leaders plan to fix this issue? Well, let's first start with Sheriff Rose. Sheriff Rose says they currently have space here, but the space is getting kind of tight at the county jail. And one of the reasons why, because inside, currently 48 jail cells are being repaired. We do not have inmates sleeping on the actual floor. Just a few minutes into our interview, Sheriff Rowe made clear every inmate has a bed, but he did share space is getting tight. We need more space, we need more staff, and we need more agencies that are working uh, within the community uh, to help uh, people. Wake County currently has 1,568 beds between the downtown jail and the Hammond location. And when those beds are filled, the jail uses beds called easy bunks that are placed in common areas. And on top of that, the jail currently has 134 job openings for detention workers. Tonight, Sheriff Rose shared what he's doing to fill the gap. We do uh, allow staff to work overtime so we can bring them in to try to fill every position. We are active recruiting. We have an uh, academy ongoing at this time. But the jail still needs space, and one solution is to open the old jail annex. That plan would add about 240 beds. Sheriff Rose says it will also take outside forces to help decrease the current jail population. So I think it's a private, public, nonprofit, faith based partnership that's going to address the conduct of people. Now, Sheriff Rowe also says he's doing a couple of other things to kind of create more space by releasing low-level, mid-level crimes, low-level crimes, I said, I should say, those that have misdemeanors. As you know, Ashley, that's only a small percentage, and Sheriff Rowe was very clear to stress that doesn't mean everybody. Okay, Julian, reporting live, thank you. The Raleigh Police Department